Uh, you feel the quake I forgot about the owlbear. <laughs> I saw the little baby. Oh God. Um... Uh, this one has my highest chance? Oh god. I am gonna need a really high roll, chat. Can I have a low bliss in the chat, please? I need a 13 or higher. It's basically a one in... Uh, okay, that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I can roll again! I don't know why. Come on, dude! Bullshit, man. Yeah, I know how numbers were a game. <laughs> the beast returns the warring kind. I didn't know what to think of an owl bear, but... It's got a lot of HP. Do you think I can take it on? I guess I gotta try. I should kill the baby first. You guys are horrible. I mean, it is within range. <laughs> no. Cut a purse, then a threat. <laughs> oh no! It even hit the little pew, pew. This might be a mistake, Chet. And what might be, I mean, it definitely is. This thing must have some sort of AoE ability. I don't believe that this is a great plan. I'm gonna spread out for a sec and hope it comes closer to me, but... Where's my, where's my AI? Or my UI? Hello? Where's my interface? Did it bug out? Does anybody know? I can literally not do anything. Oh, it's a bug? Okay, so I guess I have to load? Well, I guess it wasn't a bad moment to load anyways. I didn't want to kill the cup. No, 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 no. I just missed, I missed two rolls. There was basically a 60% chance for me to fail and I failed it twice. Nah, probably a little more than that. I do have an animal talking potion actually. Like yeah. Okay, we'll quick save it over here and then we'll do a um, animal speaking potion. Yeah, speak with animals. I don't know how long it lasts, but hopefully long enough. Hey, bud. You feel the quake of its heavy footsteps before you see it. An owlbear. Its beaked face. Dude, that is one beautiful animal, though. Is that what bears look like in real life? Or owlbears, Rod? What's this? Something weak. Something tender. Won't even have to chew you before I feed you to my son. Soft meat. Soft meat? That was my nickname in call- Wait, no, 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 no. Hold up, hold up. Um, You're injured. There's still half a spear lodged in your head. It's a splinter. I've got a bigger threat than you with worse. Um, Let me go or I'll watch your cup die before I- f <laughs> What? You'll watch your cup die before I finish you? What the f man? I mean, I am playing a total jerk, obviously, right? But like... Ah, jeez. Okay, come on, I gotta be able to do this. <sighs> I just intimidated an animal with words. Brave. Stupid, but brave. And I'm too tired to deal with brave. You can go, but you make one wrong step and I'll rip you to shreds. Okay, I can save over here. What if I take a step forward right now? I don't really know what the rules in this game are. There's a little egg over there. Hello? Okay, so it does get a bit angry. I just- I just wanted to go pet him, you know? I wonder if I can kill it. I mean, I'm playing this game like I'm an asshole anyways. May as well kill every animal I come across too. You bow 
May as well, right? I mean, it must be good XP. Miss, lol, pathetic. Imagine missing. I don't want to kill the. No, 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 not not the cup, not the cup. That's that is four steps to evil. I mean, killing its mom is pretty evil too, actually. God. I, I, yeah, I did say I'm playing a, a, an Oathbreaker Paladin, right? Like, that's what I'm playing. I'm not necessarily playing a f***ing, you know. She did provoke me. That's true, dude. It was definitely not me. It was them. How do I get 65% of rolls that miss this often? No, 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 no. Tiny claws on loco. I'm not killing the little the, the little owl bear cub. Okay, I'm not. I feel pretty evil, guys. It makes me very uncomfortable. Like killing humans or humanoids, I guess. Not the same thing, okay. From you to his dead mother. Wake, hungry. <laughs> oh no! This strike will end his suffering. I'm not. Ki what if you talking about game? What the hell, man? Food. You watch speechless as the cub begins to eat his. Oh mother. my god! Fighting chance now. That, or we've just prolonged its misery. This is a new level of evil, man. Hmm. Don't mind if I do. An owlbear egg. These are supposed to be worth a fortune. Look at what have you done? I don't know. I didn't. <sighs> What did I just roll into? Why are we sad? Don't worry about it, Agaring. I don't want to say it out loud because I feel genuinely bad. Jeez, thank you for the resub, though. 45 months, hell yeah. Nature is brutal. Yeah, but like, I had a choice in the matter, chat. It's nothing to do with nature. Nature and loco are brutal. Can I talk to the, to the cup? To your presence, the cub continues I'll to say it. himself. Loco on his killed the mother, mother, then her child started feasting on her corpse. God. <laughs> I did. Yes, that's what I did. To be fair, though, if I were to die, right? Hypothetically speaking, I die and I don't get found for a while. If my cats run out of food and I am the only meal nearby, how long do you think it'll take before they start on me? Do you think they'll at least skip dinner for tonight? A week? I feel like I'm no good anymore after a week. I I think maybe, maybe tomorrow morning. But you know, <laughs> maybe a few days. They would eat you even if they do have food. You think so? If they have the choice, they would still get a little nibble. God, I feel bad. I actually feel really bad. That's sad, man. Well, at least I got some nice loot. Loco, you're too skinny. There isn't enough. You think so? How much do you think I weigh, Cory? Uh, I'm not particularly heavy, no, but I think my, my, my cats can feast for a while. 72 kilos? 69 kilos? At least 100 kilos? I think I'm about 79. About 79 kilo, yeah. Oh, my cats can eat it for a while. Yeah, they can, they can, uh, I've been cutting a little bit lately. I used to be closer to like 84 kilos over the winter. I was getting, I was getting a little, a little, a little too much up there. So what is this on the map? It's Andric? Oh, that's the... <laughs> Guys, I leave a f like, trail of destruction behind everywhere I go. You're not actually, like, you don't have to kill everybody you encounter. 
Yeah, there's a murder trail. I, I started this playthrough off saying I play like a face tank, and I genuinely have been trying to not do it. It's... <laughs> <laughs> it's an XP trail. How, how close am I to another level up, guys? That's all we really need to know, I guess. Enough time wasted. Battle awaits. <sighs> Man, I can't believe I left that cup by itself, though. But at least the cup will live, right? <laughs> the thing that cracks me up most about him is just the stitch down the center of his face. It's so stupid. It looks so dumb. Okay, Elven Warrior trained to destroy spellcasters. On New Volsum, we meet Nova. Do you think Nova has been replaced? Okay, fine. Where's Tosh? I thought he'd be here by now. Who did we choose? I thought you... Sir, we have an incoming transmission. It's highly encrypted. Patch it through. Well, well. <laughs> the infamous Jim Rayner. My name is Nova. We should talk. Now, what would one of Meg's pet ghosts have to say to me? Tosh is lying to you. Get Tosh on comms. I'm sure he's listening in anyway. Stare. Encrypted or not. Here we go, Antonidas. <laughs> we specters be the future. You just couldn't handle it, little girl. Mm. Every ghost that became a specter has gone on a psychotic killing spree. The ones I've captured are held in New Folsom. Don't listen to her, brother. Help me bust these specters from New Folsom. And we'll bring down I'm so confused, Loco, what's going on? Tosh this is the Wings of Liberty human campaign. Not the Terrans, but the Warcraft 3 humans. New it's a custom Folsom campaign where you play the Tosh. human faction from really Warcraft 3 in StarCraft 2's Wings of Liberty. I be helping you against Minsk and my people. Yeah, Nova has got a lot more facial hair than I remember. She won't even join you. He's a psychotic time bomb. He'll be on your side. Right up until he puts a knife in your back. This be the moment of truth. Make your It's choice. as dumb as it sounds. Yeah. Ooh, I can get a sorceress that has literally the exact same ability in both options. I always go Tosh. Like, I've always gone Tosh in every serious playthrough I've ever wanted to do. Because, you know, Nova is Nova, right? I feel like that's all you really need to know. The first time I played this game ever, I, I went with Tosh. It was, it was very obvious. I always pick Nova. Maybe recently I have. I've helped Nova too often. Okay. I will help Garethos this time around then. You should have told me what you were really planning, Tosh. But I'll take your word over Dominion Assassins any day. We've come this far together. May as well see it through. You've made a poor choice, Mr. Rayner. Bold move, Mr. Rayner. I know I could count on you, brother. You always pick the ladies. Yeah, yeah, of course you do. Now. Feast your eyes on this, brother. I'm feasting right now, bro. They're locked down tight. Nova must have tipped them off. We're gonna need an army to break into that place now. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Usually the ladies pick you. Pressing X for doubt on that one. Do I eat my kiwis with cream? I feel like that's a very American question. Do I eat my kiwis with cream? No, I don't eat fruit with cream. That defeats the whole purpose of eating fruit. I understand it makes them more delicious, but... Not even my strawberries? No, I eat my strawberries with yogurt, chat. That's what I do. You deep fry it? Oh my god. No, 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 don't deep fry your fruit. Well, I guess you can, actually. It does sound delicious. It's yogurt, chat. Yogurt? Would that make you happy? I feel like this is like vitamin and vitamin all over again. Yogurt should be in a tube? What? No, 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 no. In a tube? I've never seen yogurt in a tube before. That's like milk in a bag. Why would anybody put milk in a bag? What, yogurt in a tube? Are you guys for real? Yogurt in a tube. I have never heard of yogurt in a... What am I looking at? Wait, 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 when I, when I say yogurt, Right? This is what you think of? This is not what you think of. When I say yogurt, right? This this is what I think of. There you go. We this this is a beautiful Albert Heijn. <laughs> it's very expensive these days. This is not really the supermarket we go to anymore. But like this is standard yogurt in the Netherlands. Do you have to classify or, or clarify Greek yogurt? Yeah. The boring kind? Yes. Oh no, we do have those. Like little squeezy thingamajigs.
Yeah, no, we do have those. Fair enough, fair enough. Those are pretty nice. They are, a, 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 yeah, a bit like baby fruit. Yeah, they, they are a little baby fruity, but that's okay. Yogurt in a carton? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yogurt in a carton is the way it's supposed to be, guys. Just like milk. Milk also comes in a carton. Yogurt isn't a liquid? Yogurt isn't a liquid. <laughs> How have I streamed for nearly a decade? And we have never discussed whether or not yogurt is a, <laughs> is a liquid. At what state, right? Because I think we can all agree that milk is a liquid. And that butter is a solid. <laughs> At which point, there is a transition there somewhere. Yogurt, I would consider a liquid. You think Greek yogurt is a solid? There's no way. Milk is a solid if left long enough? Yeah, but like, butter can also become a liquid. Yeah, what if you melt butter? It's a non-Newtonian fluid? That sounds too smart. Didn't we already discuss I had an IQ of 69? I've never considered non-Newtonian fluids. Can you drink? Yeah, you could drink butter. Absolutely. I don't recommend it, but... <laughs> you can drink yogurt? Yeah. We've had many strange discussions over the years. This is one that's interesting. Liquid yogurt is spoiled milk? What is this yogurt slander? I will not tolerate yogurt slander in the chat. Or yogurt. Is it, is it British English for yogurt? And American English for yogurt? Hmm, that sounds about right. Here is a photo from today's Friday morning fights in my backyard octagon. The Zuck has a backyard octagon? What's going on right now? Why, why does he have a... What's go he's got a big backyard. I think he's got a very large backyard. I do kind of appreciate that his username is literally Zuck. That's pretty funny. The problem with Elon versus Mark in a, in, a, in a fight is that, you know, Elon is like seven weight classes above Zuck. <laughs> and you know what? Mr. Mark is still gonna f*** him up. It's not even gonna be close, Chet. One punch. That's it. I saw this one this morning, bro. It's actually insane. Battle Cruiser made by Koi Tron, apparently. Made by the, he made it over two years with 800 hours. He's present at the Anime Con in Montreal, Canada. Look at this guy. I cannot hear what he's saying at all. Can we get like a walk around? Oh, sh dude, it's about the Yamato. You're right in front of Yamato. Get out. I think there was another video of somebody also at Anime Con. Yeah. Oh, God. Mr. Uh, Koi Tran uh, took off his shirt. Battle Cruiser Operational. Yeah, man. All the man does is go to the gym and build it's battle cruisers. Just a prank, Gabe. Ha ha. Funny, right? Monkers. Monkers. Thank you very much, Figaro. That is cool, dude. How big is it, though? Can I have like a walk around? I feel like I feel like it's very big. Yeah. Are there videos showing more of it? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Elite StarCraft God King influencers? Uh, no, I signed an NDA. Some pleb on Reddit. Can you tell us literally anything about the patch? Like, if it even exit? I did not sign an NDA on any Blizzard patches or anything like that, guys. Uh, I don't know anything about any updates, patches, map pool changes, and all the rest of it. But... What I think is going to happen, word on the StarCraft rumor street seems to have it that we're gonna get a, a patch and a new map pool. I am not an elite StarCraft God King influencer. I therefore did not sign an NDA. That's exactly what someone who would know everything about the patch would say. That's true, actually. That's, that's a good point. This is, by the way, what the average StarCraft influencer's physique is like, just in, in case you're unfamiliar. Not me, but, you know, I am not an elite StarCraft God King influencer, but, but other people. Loco, don't lie about your physique. You've been exposed. That's true, actually. Yes. Is steroids dangerous, tasteless? Because my penis is shrinking. Artosis, I don't know, but we need to lift. Here's me somewhere, I think, in this video. Um. Welcome to the Day 9 Daily. Today we are going to learn how to get fucking huge. Here it is, boys. There it is. Perfect. That's exactly what I look like. I look so sad, 
I mean, a little bit. Yeah, I do look a little bit sad. What is this? A Flemish giant? Another thing from Belgium? This rabbit can weigh up to 22 pounds? I've seen these in real life. They're amazing. This is a very large version of it, though. I have not seen them this big. That is an insanely big bunny. That looks like a bunny that's gonna have, like, all the problems that all those dogs have with, like, knees and elbows and hips and all that. It's a living lawnmower. Yeah. I used to go to a lot of bunny shows when I was a kid. My dad would breed bunnies. I'm not even kidding you. That's what he would call it, too. Is this bunny warren? They feed on humans? I think this bunny would probably take a nibble. If he, if he had a shot, he would probably take a nibble. Big bunny or small guy? <laughs> That's a good point, actually. If that bunny is about 10 kilos, how big is the man? About 25? He might be about 25 kilos. <laughs> yeah, no, that's a good point. But hey, it's still a big bunny. It's still a large bunny. Oh my god. That's kind of insane. In another 20 years, we can ride rabbits into battle. They're gonna be the size of a horse. There's a certain moment where you probably don't want to get bigger rabbits, guys. What animal would be the absolute scariest if it was human-sized? I can tell you actually right away. Ants. If ants were the size of humans, we would be so f yeah, Bunny was thinking the same thing right away. We would be so screwed. Cockroaches, maybe? Yeah. Yeah, the only reason why they aren't so big is that they would be crushed by their own weight. That's really the only reason. Thank God. Thank Newton for gravity. <laughs> Pretty insane, though. Cockroaches are already a menace, I guess. As a teacher, you fuel your brain every time you correct essays by 12th graders. Yeah, 12th graders are that dumb. They don't use what you teach them, ever? <laughs> you spent the entire semester teaching them shit, and by the end they still don't do anything different? That's amazing. Think you teach math, or am I completely misremembering? Math is a bit of a spicy subject as well, I guess. I feel like if you don't get math, you just don't get it. You teach math and English? I see, I see. Like, I don't know, in my mind, math just never really clicked. But I also just didn't care about it. Like, that's another big thing. I could not, like, just, it's too abstract for me, I guess. I feel like being a high school teacher must suck in general, though, dude. Ay, ay, ay. I remember me in high school, and I feel like I was kind of nice. I remember a lot of people in class. There were some absolute douchebags in my class, dude. They would literally just antagonize the teachers as much as possible. That was, like, their entire goal. And as a kid in school, I thought it was kind of funny, but... <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, well, what is what it is. You're very proficient at keeping order. <laughs> I feel like that's the main skill you need to have as a teacher, dude. In high school, anyways. You do unannounced tests from stuff that you taught 10 minutes ago? Oh, God, that's evil, dude. Man, unannounced tests. I hated those so much when I was in high school. Ay, ay, ay. You sent your students to Loco to watch good English content? Very good, very good. Yes. This is what we need. Wait, you do a surprise test and then another surprise it doesn't count? But what if you did really well? Gauntlet Millionaire Jimmy start without mineral fields? Those went into the retirement fund? Extort the colonists if you need more? How do I extort the colonists? What do you mean? Do I just kill them? Do I kill their houses? Do I get money? Where in the world did they get that voice line? There's no way, there's an official voice line. You did the right thing, uh, friends let friends massacre civilians, Jim? Is that like AI? Or is this like multiple voice lines merged together? Honestly, AI can be really cool for custom campaigns, because you could basically make any of the dudes say anything. I think this was made like two years or so ago, so there's a good chance that Mindhawk just edited multiple voice lines together. 
Yeah, maybe it was originally saying friends don't let friends massacre civilians or something. And they just took out the word don't. It's a splice from Swan's line after Save Haven. That's amazing. That's pretty sick. I think you can actually have an AI... Uh, yeah, it should be pretty manageable. You can definitely have an AI version of uh, a lot of these things. Time to extort some civilians. Yeah, that's the plan. I mean, name one good thing that civilians have done anyway. Name one. I bet you you can't. Taxes? Oh, okay, that's a good point, actually. Yeah, taxes are pretty great. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and save it here. I think this is good, but I honestly don't know. Oh yeah, they helped me in the first mission. I'd already forgotten about that. Don't leave without us! That's gonna be a civilian later today. Well, maybe that's a bit ambitious. But later on in this campaign, there is a... Don't leave without us, civilian. That's a, that's a, an F-tier civilian right there. Sure thing. There's a big Zerg counterattack towards my base right now. I think I'm dead, no? ETA. Right to hell now. Help! Somebody save me! No, 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 I did the right thing. Massacre civilians, Jim. I'm proud of you for standing up. Yeah. Keep at it, boys. The ride's on its way. I agree. I think I'm dead, though. Thought we were gunners there. Just a lot of Zerk, man. Holy crap. Okay. Okay. Help! Somebody save me! Not today, buddy. Listen, they deserved it. And you did the right thing. Friends let friends massacre civilians. That's true. I'm proud of you for standing up. Thank you, Swan. Multiple air bogies detected. ETA, right the hell now. That's really nice of, of him to say, to be honest, man. Like, I honestly felt a little guilty there. But to hear that, you know, Swan tells us that honestly, civilian lives are irrelevant. I think this is really bad. But it, it gives me. Fussy feelings inside, you know? It feels it feels really nice. It's really good for me. Memory, are you are you unbent? I feel bad. I think you're unbent. I th I think so, yeah. I hope so, anyways. All aboard the scam train. I mean the sellout train. You sure you've unbent memory? I don't know. Slash unbent all. That should take care of it. Sorry to the mods. Are you Wait, what? Did my chat just die? What just happened here? Um... <laughs> breaking, guys. I don't know... <laughs> what the heck? Uh, I think something broke somehow. I don't really know how I... Okay. Loco, have a nice vacation. I'm not going on vacation yet. I'm going on vacation at the end of the month. Are you guys trying to send me off? <laughs> Hashtag paying for Loco's vacation. Is that what's going on right now? I think you may just have. What's going on, JD? Thank you. Uh, thank you, Bobo, for 500 bits. I appreciate it. Thank you, then, JD, with a casual 20 gifted subs. That's massive, dude. Happy birthday and vacation? No, 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 no. Thank you, Bunny Warren, then, as well, with an additional 50 community subs. Holy crap, man. And then Leithrinus, gifting a sub to Diaboli. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Go buy something nice for the girlfriend? She never really wants anything, dude. It's a real problem in my life, Gil Gil. Whenever there's, like, a holiday or an anniversary or Christmas coming up, she does I don't know. Yeah, she would love another cat, but I'm not gonna get another cat. No, 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 no. Two cat, two cats is plenty of cats. Two cats is yeah. I think three cats is when I get into crazy cat territory. That's too much, man. Demnar is continuing the gifts up they got from Wolfgang. Yo, guys, that's insane though. That is the newest, highest ranked hype train I have ever seen on my channel. That is absolutely insane. If I could do, see a huge round of clappers in the chat, Bunny. 
for rounding up the total, man. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's huge. All time record shattered. You've reached new levels of support. <laughs> what the f what the fuck just came in here at the end? Ar <laughs> Suddenly Argyle also fills up the entire chat box. My god, thank you so much, man. Casual 30 gifted subs. Ay 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 ay. Are there still any non-subs in the chat at this point? There's no way. We literally had more subs gifted just now than f total subs or t t there are still <laughs> the f ninjas of the stream over here, dude. They're fucking somehow dodging. <laughs> it's like one of those laser obstacle courses, and they f have like slid their way through all of the lay and somehow they did. <laughs> How did you guys not get one? That's impressive. There's still so many. That's a <laughs> that's insane. Wow, that's impressive. Wait, JD, you're a non-sub? Okay, Swedish guy also <laughs> joining in, my god. 337 subs, 275 viewers? Well, we're still pretty early in the stream, that's insane, man. Okay, well, that brings the sub numbers back up. Ay, 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 ay. More gifted subs than viewers. Yeah, so who got the gifted subs then, right? Like, this is always a question. I know there is some sort of algorithm where, like, it gifts the subs to people that, like, are currently not watching? Yeah, but like, I don't know how it decides who gets a sub. Loco, when's the retirement party? You think I can retire? After, uh, like, this many subs? I don't live a fancy life, Dekaria, but... I might have to eat bread for the rest of my life on the str <laughs> I will retire and play video games. That's a good point, actually. That, that's a good point. I'm gonna retire and play video games. Mansion tour when? My home is indeed basically a mansion. It's true. I think if I retire from playing video games, you gotta, you gotta send somebody to come and, and check on me. That's, that sounds very unhealthy. If there's ever a day where I will not play video games anymore, I'm probably, uh, I'm probably in some trouble, dude. There's no way. Hey, uh, thank you guys so much for the generosity, though. Seriously, that is... All jokes aside, incredibly generous. The insurance paid you too much for your broken TV. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, there you go. That fixes that. Th thank you, Nick Mood, as well. I thank you, Oberstadt. And the Pete gifting us up to Shy Lily. Welcome back, Shy Lily. Shy Lily, big enjoyer of the stream. She's now a, uh... Seven month subscriber with zero messages in the chat ever. Very nice. Does she still stream? I haven't seen her in ages. I think she probably does. Three days ago, no passion confirmed. No passion. Imagine taking three days off. Thank you, Modbell, as well, for the $10, man. Anonymous gifting a sub to Cero. Cero actually uses my emotes, guys. He doesn't say much in my chat, but he's been subscribed for 25 months. Hold up. How did he get subscribed for 25 months? The last time he t said something in the chat was in 2021? More like top 10,000? Was this Cyril with a roast? I have no idea what this is all about. I held a leg festival for the lads. I don't know, guys. Oh, he was calling me top 10,000? Yikes, dude. I have a hard time he just comes in to roast me. Oof, that's a little painful, if that's what it is. Maybe, Peter. I'm not gonna go with that option now. <sighs> hey, um, thank you though. Seriously, that is also very generous. Sorry, I feel like I've not been playing any games in ages. Brutalisk spawns will avenge the Brutalisk endless dealing more damage to the long- What? Brutalisk spawns will avenge the Brutalisk endlessly? Dealing more damage the longer they live. The Brutalisk has a scent for command centers. A command center? Like, okay, no, sorry, I tried making a pun there. What? So the Brutalist comes out into the map and kills my command center? Psst. Can I play games now? I don't know if I can. I feel like I'm mentally kind of f at this point. 
Everything's gonna be a mess from here on out. Thank you so much, guys. Seriously. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm a little broken. I'm gonna need to take a nap. Did the sub goal break? Did it stop counting? No, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Man, sub goal is looking big. Hey, yeah, yeah. We had a bit of a, a bit of a sub war earlier today, where suddenly, in the course of like ten minutes, we had like four hundred subs coming in or something insane like that. <laughs> very, very cool, dude. Yeah, it was actually really sick. Loco was trying to tell people to stop, but he was powerless. I was like, yeah, guys, stop, stop throwing money at me. Oh, oh no. Not more, okay, guys. Guys, stop it now. And they were like, no, Loco, here, take another 10 bucks. Here's 50 bucks. I was like, guys. <laughs> Loran won't starve this month. That's nice. I don't, I don't think she would starve, no. You gotta disable this thing, dude. Yeah. Oh, jeez, okay. <laughs> uh, my dude is not scared. Okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go. There you go, good, good, good. Keep going, keep going. What are you doing right now? Are you guys dumb? You guys are pretty dumb. Okay, yes. Critical success, baby. Losers, come over here. That was unnecessary. What are you doing? Death is close at hand. You're taking a lot of damage because you stood in the fire. How do I... How do I... I, I need water. Yeah, water? Really? Mate, I am... S I am trying to throw f water, man. How do I throw the water? Oh, he's dead. Okay, great. Okay, just pick him up, I guess. This idiot stood in the fire. Uh, it doesn't want to throw! It, it tried throwing it earlier, but it didn't work. Maybe I need to give it to somebody else first? <laughs> he's f dead. God damn. He just stood there in the fire, man. It's like World of Warcraft raiding all over again. You can't throw a pot of water on yourself. Like, you can't throw it. You have to give it to another character and then throw it or something? That was weird. Oh man. Okay, fine. We'll, we'll, just, we'll just get lucky again. We'll just get lucky again. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We just have to roll like another seven times. Okay, good, good, good. Easy win, easy win, easy win. Here we go, here we go. Keep, keep going. I tried throwing it on the ground, but he didn't want to do it. I guess I should have passed it to somebody else right away. Okay, good. Yeah, I've ungrouped now, so this should make it uh, all a whole lot easier. Uh, I think it's these pressure plates over here that I still have to, like... Quick save, successful. Best be on my way. Mate, I really like a lot of aspects of this game, but my god, is some of it kind of dumb. Ay, 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 ay. I'm probably just misplaying it, though. I, I don't know, like, I don't quite understand what I'm doing wrong for a lot of those things. But it's okay. Oh, yeah, to be a VTuber. Wait, do VTubers need multiple cameras? Gabe, you're a VTuber. How many cameras do you have? Dita Hunter is also a VTuber. He's got a JPEG. You can use only one. Only one? I feel like that's some low-level VTubing right there. It's one to track. Some VTubers have more camera for more precise movement tracking. Oh. I see. That's actually very clever. So they have like a, a second camera just for motion cap. People use body tracking suits for streaming? Really? What does something like that even look like when you're like doing it on Twitch? That sounds hardcore, dude. The first thing I find is a $13,000 suit. Look at Miko. 
Elaser? I don't think Elaser is a VTuber. Code Miko. She uses a body suit? Okay, let's see. Oh, the I am single again video has got a lot of views. I wonder why. I don't, I don't, I don't think this is quite my, my type of content to watch, personally. But this is like, this is, I guess it's a VTubing avatar, but it's very different than what I think of when I hear the word VTuber. Look at Zentreya, it's bitter. I've been distracted. Oh, sorry, Watopia, I got distracted by some other things. Zentreya. Which one's Zentreya? This one? I am, I, I, what's going on, man? Just give me a fucking... What's going on, guys? This one has a lot of replays. Bro, bro, this is too, it's too, I can't, I can't, there's too much going on, dude. I am, a, this is like when I properly feel old. Like, I look at these videos and I just, there's too much. It feels like I'm watching a very long TikTok. Ah, here we go. It's a mocap suit? Oh, there we go. But like, this seems like a lot of effort, no? And she looks very similar to her avatar as well. She could just stream with a regular camera, that would be way easier. <laughs> I think he's intentionally ignoring the YouTube links. No, 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 just, just your links. Yeah, she must have spent so much time on this. It's so much effort. I guess, yeah, it's a hobby as well, I see. Oh my god, so you gotta stream with gloves on? That's kind of cool, though. I see. I see. No need to do makeup then? Yeah, fair enough, but you would have to put on your tracker suit and... and it <laughs> you just have a PNG that reacts to your mic? There you go, that sounds much easier. But I guess that's always a thing, right? Like, uh, somebody starts the thing, in this instance, VTubing, and then somebody takes it one step further and one step further, and at some point, the, uh, the, the, the regular VTubing then becomes sort of out of reach of a lot of people, I guess, but that's fair enough. You have the same with, like, YouTube people, you know? Like, all of the tech YouTubers these days on YouTube use these stupid high-end cameras. I remember when MKABHD, like, had to, like, step it up to try and differentiate, uh, differentiate, differentiate himself, there you go. And they got this like entire robot arm that is supposedly like half a million dollars just to be able to shoot intros and stuff. It's like, that's a lot. That Shout out to Linus. Linus is killing it, right? Literally. I don't use a red camera, no, no, no. I don't think I can watch this with music though. No. That's kind of cool. But then you have to put on your entire mocap suit every day before you start your stream. Oh no, I would like to see that Bowser Chops. That sounds kind of interesting. But these suits are very pricey though. A hundred dollar markerless mocap versus twenty five thousand optical mocap. Right. Yeah, I guess the sky is the limit. You can go pretty far, huh? So wait, what about this Esmond Gold AI? Bowser Chops said something in the chat, but Esmond Gold AI. About seven hundred people try to tell me that Athene did an AI version of me. Here we go. Let's look at it. Esmond is asking, what do you think about Starforge PCs? Starforge PCs? Dude, why would I spend ridiculous amounts of money on a gaming computer when I can spend the same money on Dr. Pepper? Like, I'm just not into that whole expensive gaming gear thing. But honestly, if you like it and have the means, more power to you, why not? Whoa! That's actually kind of nutty, though. So this is actual Esmond Gold. This is AI Esmond Gold talking about his own company. Dude, like, do you guys see this? This is what I have to deal with. 
I have to read these ridiculous True. questions. Like, holy fuck, man. True. But, yeah, I guess if you squint, maybe it kind of looks like a penis. I mean, it's not a big deal or anything. Okay, uh, that is uh, that is pretty wild. That is pretty crazy. Yeah, I know a theme made the uh, the Trump versus Biden AI. Is that still going, by the way? Are they still streaming on Twitch? I haven't heard of a theme in ages, and then suddenly it pops up with uh, Trump versus Biden. Are they? Are, I think they're still live. Yeah. Okay, it's kind of died off a little bit because nobody is really like this was very popular for a little while. So this is an AI debate, I guess. This has been on for months now. Can we see what the most popular clip is on this channel over the last... Can we find this somehow? Featured clip? Try not to laugh? And can someone please explain to me the meaning behind choo 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 how did they do that? I think it's I think it's like um I think it's like a donation message or whatever. And remember, nobody takes a dump like I do. It's you, Jay. Okay. I saw some really messy, th messed up things though. Biden will make Bioshock. As for you, hey Matib, I remember you from way back when you won that Halloween I, I poster. You clearly have great taste, unlike this knuckle dragging Neanderthal we're debating with. And to answer your question, Bioshock Infinite wasn't bad. It just suffered from being overshadowed by the masterpiece that was Bioshock 1. But let me tell you something, folks. When I'm president for another four years, we're going to make Bioshock 4 so damn good, they'll rename it Biden Shock. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I have some more chat messages to demolish like the fake news they are. Okay. All right. All right. Fair enough. Yeah, these AI parody things are becoming pretty interesting. I feel like there must be people, though, that, like, you can get these, you can get these AIs to say anything, right? I feel like there must be, especially older people, right? Like, a couple generations older than me that would take this... For reality, right? If they don't have their glasses on and everything, they see the random Facebook video. It's gonna be interesting. Another election cycle and it'll be very difficult to distinguish, I think. Yeah, it can be very convincing. Can we get a written permission to create a loco AI? I don't know, man. That seems pretty scary. <laughs> what did you just link, Edzilla? <laughs> this guy joined me on a beach day chair in Thailand. Who is he? Slash r slash what is this bug? It could be a plant. I don't know, brightly colored, possibly poisonous slash venomous. Yeah, yeah. Definitely poisonous. Barren caterpillar. What? Why do the dangerous ones look so cool? <laughs> this entire subreddit is just about identifying bugs. <laughs> That's so stupid. It's a hummingbird. It's a bug. Oh my god, it does look like a strange bug. This guy is super cute. Is it what I think it is? I have no idea what it is. This landed on me a few weeks ago. I recently found out about this subreddit. That is kind of a, a cute bug though, I'm not gonna lie. He's frosted. I have never seen a bug so cute. What What is going on, man? What's going on with the way that people... What What is happening here? Oh yeah, there are so many crazy insects out there. I live in the Netherlands, okay? We don't really get- like, the scariest insect we get over here is a wasp. I'm pretty sure. There- there's- there might be some- okay. Most dangerous insect, the Netherlands. Oh yeah, I guess ticks. Yeah, ticks. Ticks are definitely the ones that mess you up. That's fair enough. Dangerous animals in the Netherlands. This guy? No, I don't think that's fair. Just because he's red hair does not make him dangerous. Hedgehogs? <laughs> These are some of the most dangerous creatures that you're going to find in Holland. Yeah, we are. T these are terrifying, man. Jellyfish. Okay. A fox. Bro, the Netherlands is dangerous. Dangerous. A kissing bug? I don't know what that is. A wild boar. Right. I think the wild boars in the Netherlands only live in protected, like, nature areas. So, places that humans can't really go to. But maybe there are some that are hanging out in areas as well where... There's wolves. Yeah, these came out of Germany recently. They now talk to humans, basically, though. They basically steal your lunch. It's pretty insane. Oh, you can find wild boars roaming? Okay. 
Well, fair enough. A deer? Yeah, these are not the most dangerous animals in the world, man. I could win against a deer in a one-on-one -on -one battle, I'm pretty sure. May probably not, actually. Never mind. Maybe I could... No, I probably not. <laughs> Clueless. <laughs> yeah, ticks. Ticks are obviously the one. They will... F Dude, these guys will just run away. They're not gonna fight me, will they? I should do a video about me fighting a deer. Oh, dear. Yeah, these horns are gonna mess me up. Yeah, you're probably right. If they run into you, yeah, yeah. No, if he runs into me, that's... Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty scared. Yeah, no, that'd be bad. Most dangerous animals of Romania? The lynx? These are cool, though. These are really cool. These are kind of like my cats, except they have little fluffs on their... On their, on their and they have, like, short little tails as well, right? These are cute. Black Widow Spider? Okay, f*** those. European Bison? Okay. What? I think that's a goat. That's probably a goat. A wild boar? A pelican? A horned viper? There's a goat and there's a viper. I see. I've seen the goat make many a viper. There's a horse? A hamster? The Romanian hamster? What? I think I could win in a one-on-one -on -one fight with a Romanian hamster, chat. What did I do? There are about 3,000 of these species found in Romania, although they're not aggressive, you should stay away. You might never know how they will respond. What do you mean, dude? How do they- what, what do you mean? Have you seen hamsters? The gray wolf? The brown bear? Okay, yeah, no, I could not win against- the. De I could definitely not win against- Well, no, 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 I could def- This is definitely some, yeah, search engine optimization. Also, a good chance that people are gonna link this to other people and then it works, right? And it gets like, yeah. The brown toad. One of the creatures you're going to encounter? They usually thrive in orchards. They have a venom that will cause death if it delivers to your body. Top 10 most dangerous animals, Australia? Oh god, I already hate this page. The box jellyfish? Yeah, these f*** you up. The taipan snake? It looks pretty. Saltwater crocodile? <laughs> AKA salties? Is this what you guys call them in Australia? Salties? Oi mate! It's a salty! I thought that's what we call Terran players, yeah. Blue ringed octopus. Damn, these look sick. Stonefish, yeah, these f*** you up. Redback spiders, these f*** you up. Brown snake, tiger snake. Great white shark. Ah, oh, jeez, I'm gonna screw- oh, okay, we're gonna- okay, we made it. We made it to the other side. Look, okay, here's my favorite animal. Cause of an Indian purple frog? Bro, it sounds like a Windows error sound. Oh look, he's coming. <laughs> he's got no neck. That's what's cursed about it. Like, his head is connected directly to his shoulders. He might be sending effects. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. Do frogs usually have necks? I think so. Yeah, they have little necks. This guy doesn't have a neck at all. What about this frog? Yeah, I know this guy. This guy has been memed many times. Assist me to walk minor Kerala hash belt. Uh, no, 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 no. It's, it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday, Bruce. Thank you now for the 18 months. Welcome. This thing is pretty cute. Yeah. Bell pepper gang, rice up. No, 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 no. Nobody's part of bell pepper. But be bell peppers suck, guys. Come on, we all know this. That frog also had no neck. Most dangerous animal, Belgium. I'm sure. I'm sure Belgium will give us all the what information. What have I just joined? Uh, we are trying to find out dangerous animals in different countries. Equable. Thank you for the 82. The Eurasian wolf. Damn, that's a good shot, though. The common adder. Okay. The wild boar. The processionary pine caterpillar? We have those in the Netherlands. Yeah, I guess those are dangerous. The black widow? Really? Those live in Belgium? These eight-legged creatures do occasionally make an appearance? In this Western European country? Would we consider Belgium to be Western European? I feel like these websites are a little, a little sketchy, guys. Don't f put that on your finger? Are you dumb? Are you- you must be pretty dumb, I'm not gonna lie. Why would you put a tick on your finger? The weaver fish? What do you mean? I don't know, man. The most dangerous animals of Norway? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, fine. 
Yeah, okay, sure, sure. The Wolverine? It's basically a bear. The Moose? What is this? The Muskox? The Moose? These things are sick, dude. These things are beautiful. Oh, it's the Musk Ox. <laughs> I thought it was the Muskox. But it's the Musk Ox. I see. Alright, alright, alright. The Wolf? The Eurasian Lynx? Damn. Might not look. It's like you, dude. Just different color and a bit bigger. European adder. Yeah, more ticks again. Fair enough. Ticks basically are the most dangerous animal in the Netherlands. That's what we learned. Yeah. Most dangerous animals of Japan. Bro, everybody gets bears. Why don't we get bears? Wild boars. Buffer fish. The viper box jellyfish. Snakes. <laughs> I like that it just says snakes. Just snakes in general. There's no clarification needed there. Giant murder hornets. Fun. Redback spiders. Hey, there they are again. Okay, this is for Switzerland. The wild boar. The red deer. The wolf. The European viper. The golden eagle. Really? Are there any instances of a golden eagle attacking a human? There are about 700 of them in the Swiss Alps. They may go after larger mammals when they have already died. They have potential to cause serious damage. Right, I also have potential to cause serious damage to a golden eagle. But I feel like there are very few golden eagle attacks. If you're seriously injured, an eagle might try and eat you. They're not picky eaters and any open flesh wound could attract them. If you're hurt, immediately seek a safe space. That's brilliant stuff. That's one way to go out. The bearded vulture? The li- oh, It's you again, dude. Are there bears in Switzerland? Officially, no. Interesting. Consider it done. Strictly business. Strictly... Business. There's still two rates that I need to get, or rates, uh, specters rather, that I need to snipe over here. Am I talking about you again? Sick mod? You are a pretty sick mod, Echo Steel. You're pretty ill, dude. You're the illest. Uh, yeah, I hope you go well soon, dude. Okay. I get a little bit of hacking myself. Move her to cause- okay. I- I can- okay, nice. You think our nuke silos can get hacked in real life? That seems like a problem. See? She did that in seconds! Does she have the floppy disks though? With the launch codes. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, sis. The US nuclear silos still use five and a quarter inch floppy disks? I also use a five and no. <laughs> no, 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 chat. Okay, I have a nuke. What do I do with it? Uh, here's a specter. Where's the other specter? I don't believe there's a specter over here. I guess we'll start here. Yeah, yeah. Does this complete the? Ob it completes the objective! No! I have to re her? Oh god. Ah, take it! Where is he? Oh, he's right over here? Is that him? Oh, bro, this guy is so dead. I meant the raven, actually. The raven was so dead right there. So, this is 125 damage. Or is this say in France? Damage. He's got 80. Big bottom. Boom. Okay, good. Say again. Okay, good. Okay, good. Strictly business. Acknowledged. On route. Uh -huh. That's the nuke I was originally aiming for. But hey, this will do the trick. I lost the raven. That's okay. We don't care about that dude anymore. 
Ravens are always remote controlled? I guess so, right? I guess Ravens are like, um... Nova here. Strictly business. They're basically just robots. Kind of like birds. Birds are also remote controlled, right? What? Bullshit. I should probably just safe scum my way to that because it's not it's not useful. Okay, Nova. Now little tippy. Yeah, 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 yeah. There it is. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Good. Yeah, she had to walk around on her tippy toes. Oftentimes she doesn't do that. Oh yeah, putting your face on thumbnails increases views tremendously, Clem. Yeah. Um, it, it depends from channel to channel, and it depends on what you can otherwise put on a thumbnail. But for example, this particular video, it's got about, I think, 100,000 views now. I feel like if I didn't have my face on this thumbnail, and it would just be a bunch of glowy boys, it would probably get about half that amount of views. Like, literally. It sounds very silly, but title and thumbnail are incredibly important for a video's performance. I sometimes feel that the title and the thumbnail are more important than the content, which is very annoying. Although I do feel like I'm pretty good at titles and thumbnails, but it, it, yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of insane how important those two things are. Title and thumbnail, absolutely massive. Because like the thing is, you, you go to YouTube, right, and you get bombarded by like 17 different images all at the same time. And uh, you have to decide which one do I want to click. And you probably don't give any of those images any of your attention for more than like, you know, a hundredth of a second. I'm doing a lot of long videos too. Yeah, I'm doing a lot of long form content, so it's, uh, it's already quite competitive there too, so yeah. Anyways, I have been putting my face on thumbnails lately, and it seems to work out quite a bit. It is kind of dumb, though, because I quite literally sit here, like, I press the record button, and I literally sit here like... Like, I literally make dumb faces in this camera, and then I Photoshop myself onto a thumbnail, and I cringe for, like, the entire 10 minutes that it takes. It's painful, dude. But it is what it is. The Vulture guy is jacked? Whoa! Damn, dude. This guy has biceps the size of his head. He looks like you? Just because you're bald doesn't make you muscular, okay? That's not how that works, Meerkats. Stimpak, not even once. This makes me want to do Stimpaks, I'll be honest with you. This guy has even got his feet on the floor. Is this how he breaks? Do you think they have got breaks over here, or do they just put their feet on the floor? Welcome to the Kuprulu sector. I finished my back tattoo of Korhal, Moria, and Umoja. I have never seen anybody tattoo a StarCraft planet on their backs. No matter the cost? That is very niche. Yeah. I wouldn't do it, but been about five years in the making, but I wrapped this up. Wanted to get all three Terran capitals. Damn. Where girls cried, where boys cried, where men cried, and where legends cried. True, dude. I'm still not over Tessadar sacrificing himself. This was a sad moment though, dude. Yeah, I, I, mean, I mean, this is where girls cried, but uh, I remember watching the Titanic for the first time when I was like 14 or whatever. I think I teared up a little bit, guys. Yeah, yeah, that's not the most manly thing of me to admit, but obviously, Tess yeah, here comes the god through Thor. <laughs> that feeling when Banelings Infestors and Disruptors get nerfed, this is a risky click. Is it okay? Fine, I'll I'll, I'll click it. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right, all right, fine. Uh, I was ready to uh, put my Twitch account on the line for that one. Request: Bring back the pylon show to discuss the balance changes. We don't need fifty solo YouTube videos. <laughs> no, I agree. Just watch mine. Dan, just watch mine. Nobody else. Okay, you're welcome. Over 1,000 Redditors surveyed, majority thinks Protals don't go far enough. Bro, StarCraft balance is not a democracy, okay? I, 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 I feel like a lot of people think it should be a democracy. But it's not. <laughs> you can <laughs> make Protals OP. It's so dumb. Protals needs more buffs. So the guy voted that himself as well. That's amazing. Oh my god, please tell- I hope the responses here are people telling him that it's not a democracy. 
Any poll without the just want to see the results option is not worth much, especially with such lack luxury. Okay. We didn't even play the damn patch. Yeah. I got a little bit upset when I read Reddit discussing balance. Like, it, I, I used to think it doesn't really bother me anymore, but since it's not really been that big of a discussion point over the last year or so, it's kind of wild. I like, I don't know, I find myself getting pretty negative reading all of the over here. It really feels more and more like the BattleNet forums. It really does, yeah. You get frustrated reading Reddit, period? Yeah. This is me, dude. I'm so excited about the new patch and freshness it brings. Br forget the negativity. 100%. Like, obviously, they're gonna have to adjust some of the values here and there if it turns out to be bad, right? But, like, the general purpose is good. Like, most people that post on Reddit don't play the game. I can guarantee you. I would say that probably, like, 20% of the people that actively post on Reddit actually play StarCraft 2 1v1. The vast majority of people don't. I actually want to take a little field trip as well to the Battle.net forums. How do you think the Battle.net forums are taking the Battle.net or the, the balance suggestions? I, I want to have a look. Uh, StarCraft 2 forums, Battle.net. I wonder how the Battle.net forums are finding the suggested balance proposal so far. Let's have a look at the general discussion. Do you think they realized yet that there is a Battle.net? Or sorry, a balance proposal? Do you think they've realized it yet? Um, I don't see... Okay, I see a couple things over here. Nerf EMP, buff Colossi DPS, buff Chrono Boost, buff Feedback. This was 10 days ago, though. Zerk is overpowered. It's my new main race. <laughs> Protoss and Terra need to play poker every game against Zerk to not be behind. If they play standard, they are behind. When Terra or Protoss are passive, Zerk outgrows them, playing whichever style preferred. It's pretty hilarious. It really takes naivety to play Protoss or Terran. I'm not gonna be a tryhard peasant. I would rather be an ape with easy wins. <laughs> this is 100% bait. There is no way that this guy is not just trying to sprinkle a little bit of bait on the forums. As a Terran player, the two things that I personally hate about Zerk are the inability to do damage with any units. Insane amount of control of Terran units prior to engagement. <laughs> what? Protoss has the same problem, even double oracle cannot do anything. Doesn't matter if you open Hellion, Bio, Libs, Banshee, or even Battlecruiser, Zerk deflects all, like it was nothing. I always like to play a little game whenever I go on the Battle.net forums, and that is, uh, do you think this guy has more career letter games than forum posts? So do you think he's played more than 512 career games? Oh, he's hiding his profile. Okay. Yeah, that tells me enough. There should be a button over here that says view profile, but he's hidden it. You can go into the settings and hide that. So, okay, I know enough. Don't forget that Zerk also needs to split Bane links when dealing with siege tanks or target fire them. Yeah, true. What's going on, Eden? Thank you for the 29. I appreciate you. Hope you're doing well. Zerk never splits their Bane links versus siege tanks. True, dude. Never. Maybe pros are doing it. Oh, okay. Well, that... Is counter anyways. So that's Protoss has three ground units attacking air Stalker, soft counter to Mutas, Sentry, Archon, hard counter to Mutas, Corruptors, but awful versus Brute Lords. I'm not gonna talk PvZ because I'm Terran. <laughs> You're talking PvZ. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. This guy is not discussing PvZ while discussing PvZ. It's they, they, I don't think the Battle.net forums has yet to realize that there is a new balance proposal. I don't see any post about it here. Like, this is a hotfix that was a little bit ago. Um, I don't think the Battle.net forums have quite realized that there is a, uh, a balance proposal yet. Mothership is useless now? Where do you see that? No, that's, is that new, you think? Oh, this is two days ago. Wait, is this with the new balance changes suggestion or no? Wait, no, this is August 22. Okay, I guess, it, no, it might be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every 60 seconds for one 3.5 range slow zone that only reduced 33%, who would build that? How would additional two seconds of Guardian Shield make Sentry more useful in any scenario? I mean, Senekio? It's like Seneca, but slightly different. Tempest needs more damage or more speed. Acceleration is the least important part to be... I just don't see how this pro this patch does anything meaningful about Protoss. 
Protals has no hope. I'm not going to wait for another year. It's 50%, not 33%. This is a multiplication by a factor of 0.5. Cutting DPS in half, not a division by 1.5. Oh, got him. I'm legitimately confused where you're getting this from. Yeah, no. I, it, this guy didn't quite yet realize that there were new balance suggestions. Interesting, though, how, like, nobody... Like, there's no... There's no forum post? Nobody is discussing it? That's so funny. Rainer didn't deserve to win. <laughs> this is about Gamers 8. They need to nerf Banelings. It takes no skill to make Banelings and kill bases. Cure and Clem played their hearts out with Micro, etc. Well, good thing for you, man. They are indeed nerfing Banelings. It's truly a magical place. Oh, wait, where did you see this? Balance team releases proposed patch to buff Protals. They buff Terran and nerf Zerk and Toss. I guess they're killing the game before all these other RTSs come out. <laughs> Okay. I thought the title you wrote over here, though, was that they're propo they're, they're buffing Protals according to your title, but your message in the, in the post says the exact opposite. You're insane, Zerk is the weakest race, just because Sarah and Dark are the best players in the game doesn't mean it's because of the race they play. Maybe they are the best because Zerk is overpowered, has this thought ever crossed your mind? It's the same guy again. Every time. It's the dude who hit his, po his profile. Yeah, his profile button is not over there. They buff Terran. What, where? Ghost, huge nerf. Cyclone redesign, which servers no purpose. I don't know what this unit is now supposed to counter. From what I understand, the Cyclone redesign is actually a little too much. Apparently, it's basically all people make now. But anyways, I haven't really played it with it yet. Raven, nerf, Medivac. Okay, no, no, no apps, no. Widowmine, okay, the only witch might have been buffed, but the change is very subtle, and I don't think Terrans were even asking for this. It burrows twice as- it, it, it unburrows twice as fast. How is that not a significant change? <laughs> uh, I'm very upset about the Viper change, guys. The Viper change really upsets me greatly. Vipers now deal less damage to structures? when they use the consume ability on them. What the f is the balance team thinking, dude? Absolute insanity. I can't believe it. I won't even be able to kill my own hatchery anymore as easily. There was a brief period where Terran would go Hellion Cyclone. It was known as, quote unquote, Battle Mech. A brief period, as in like seven periods over the course of the last four years. Predominantly, though, now nah, it was just something that pros would keep in their back pocket to steal of a game off of an opponent during tourneys, and then they'd go back to playing bio. That's not entirely incorrect. That's true. Yeah. The, the Roddy, yeah, I saw Roddy's tweet about this. The StarCraft community talking about the irrelevant Viper change. 60 impactful changes to the state of the game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is gonna cost me a viking or two. Okay. What? The hell, man? So it only uses Vortex when there's more than five? Uh, it's currently doing its purification thingy, though. There's still 6,000 hit points. I am not out DPSing it, so I'm gonna have to jump here at some point. Before that bar. Oh, okay. Oh, that's that's fun. Sure. Additional infested show up from somewhere. The purifier sent our units into a dimensional warp We're running out of time. should only be temporary, though. Nah, it, it, I don't have enough. That's the mission filled, right? That's the end of the mission. I don't know when you technically lose. On trigger or... I guess I'll go back to this one. We'll send in five Vikings on the thing. And we'll try and kill... Uh, one, two, three, four, five. We'll try and kill the rest. I 
gotta be careful about that stormy guy. They're stormy, man. Do you think I get this? I mean, if this ain't it, I don't know, man. <laughs> it's gonna overtake the bar, though. That progress bar is not gonna complete. I'm gonna have to jump this. Okay, go, everybody. Please tell me I got it. Please tell me I got it. 200 HP? 150? The Protoss are retreating. You've done it. You are as cunning as the stories say, James Raynor. I think the colonists are all very dead. These colonists will be vindicated. Nah, those colonists were all super dead. Ay, ay, ay. I think this mission was way too complex, dude. But maybe if you do it like another 10 times, it'll be smooth. Maybe it's because it's just... It took 23 minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I've been streaming for four hours and I've only done one mission today. This is the first one, but it took me 23 minutes in case you're wondering. Yeah, no, it was 23 minutes and 11, 11 seconds. Jeez, though. That was insane. I tried it on the first- yeah, yeah, I got it on the first try. My god. That was a funny Greta meme in the memes and clips yesterday. I thought I found a really funny video that I thought was really funny. I watched this like seven times yesterday, and Aran was like, yo, why, you, why do you think this is funny? I'm gonna show you guys, maybe some of you will find it funny too. I thought it was very funny. But then again, my humor is kind of dumb. Uh, let me see. I posted this yesterday on the Discord server. I was on the beautiful TikToks. It's the gospel for Gen Z. Mary was a pygmy girl for God and was simping for him in prayer when the angel Gabriel appeared to her and said, you've passed God's vibe check and he wants you to be the mother of the main character, the son of the top G. She said, how can this be since I promised him my body count will always be zero? He said the same about cuffing season for the Holy Spirit will live rent free in you. So she said bet, and Gabriel left her unread, and she let the Holy Spirit cook. <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was so funny, but this is an entire Discord account, or sorry, TikTok account, dedicated to Gen Z Bible season, or, or Bible stories, rather. It's all of uh, the well-known stories told exactly like that, which I think is so funny. What is this? Madagascar, Gladagascar, Sadagascar, Nadagascar? Meta dead gas <laughs> Okay, alright, alright, I see, I see. <laughs> and she said that. <laughs> the best part is, though, I watched a couple of those videos, right? Because I thought they were funny. And I didn't understand, like, half of them. I was trying to understand what was going on, but... Okay, there's one more. One more that I thought was pretty funny. Holy bro was in the top cheese house praying. An angel appeared, and bro was shooketh, and was about to nope out of there. But the angel said, bro, chill. God is feeling you and heard your prayer, and your wife Elizabeth will have a child. Now call him John, and it'll be busted, for he will be declared valid by God, and he will eat and leave no crumbs. He will let the Holy Spirit cook within him, and will help many understand the assignment and pass God's vibe check. But Zechariah said, bruh, you play him too much. I don't think I can continue watching this because of the music in the background, but just the whole concept of that account, I find so funny that someone decides to make an account like that. <laughs> There's like a dozen of them. Uh oh. Uh, uh. Do you think Gil can make this without dying? Probably not. We'll try and jump towards her, I guess. Yeah, every time one of those things dies, she, uh. I don't know. There's still one of them available. I don't know where he is, though. I think he's over here somewhere. Anyways, she takes a lot of damage. Her max HP goes down, but I think at this point we can just start nuking her. Oh, it's literally right here? The heck? 
I didn't even notice. <laughs> Can't wait to play this too. THX for your content and the wonderful streams and videos. Thank you so much, Dwarf Jern. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Pew. Texas? Never heard of them. Loco is inspired. That is not true. Dutch tax authorities not that's guys. I'm on a list. I'm I'm on I don't want to be on the list. That was a sick fight. I really like that. Thank you very much, Dwarf Jerm, for the support. I'm being audited next week. <laughs> so we heard you don't pay tax. <laughs> Oh, I got a okay. You can't reach this, mate. Mate, it's it's right there. It's, haha. <laughs> it's it's like right. <laughs> minus five hundred, minus five hundred, guys. I think is what we call this. I'm not upset. I'm just angry. Oh wait, no. I'm not angry. I'm just disappointed. I forget. I forgot the line. For the Belusting Dienst? No! Not the Belusting Dienst! This guy in direct strike? Ooh! A symmetrical heart? You know what? I dig it! That's a different way of doing symmetry. Although, I am seeing a, a, a baneling of. Uh, that's a. Ah! Oh no, it's not perfectly symmetrical, but I. No, it's not even remotely symmetrical. Well, I mean, the units aren't symmetrical. It's a bit of a mess, but I guess we'll make it work. Yeah, you know what? I think we'll allow it. That's kind of cute. You guys have never... Yeah, I see this all the time. People don't quite realize that there's a missile turret guy. There's a guy inside of the missile turrets. Hoping that the new patch will make mid-game more interesting to watch slash play. That's me right here, dude. This is me right here. Why don't missile turrets take any, any supply? Because they're self-sufficient, you know? Like, the bottom area, the bottom end right over here is like a little indoor farm. It's like a greenhouse. There's solar panels over here on the top section of it. And then, you know, they have like these growing lights over here. So, you will notice once uh, once a day, the missile turret guy goes indoors, waters the plants, makes dinner, and then continues sitting in a seat. So, that's why it doesn't cost any supply. It's obvious, Chet. Read a book. Same reason the guy flying the barracks doesn't take up supply? Exactly. I look like I've never aged. You've been watching my videos for a long time. Really? Hello, everyone. You're saying I never aged? Let's pull up the Christmas video, guys. Hello, everyone. My name is Loco. Otherwise known as Simon, and I just... I look like a baby, dude. This was 10 years ago, though. This is... This is 2012. God, that's long. That's a long time ago. I look old, dude. I look old these days. This was like yesterday? Really? You remember watching this in 2012 again? That's a long time ago. Look at my posture, dude. Like, my posture is definitely not great these days. But I feel like I'm like right over here. I kind of feel like my microphone would be touching my chin. I must have been 20 in this video. Yeah, something like that. Pretty old, dude. I like how most of the views on this video are from recent years. Nobody actually watched this video when I uploaded it. I feel like most of these three and a half thousand people that watched it must have watched it over the last few years. Just for the memes. <laughs> it's some top tier cringe. It is very painful. Yeah. Nobody wants to be Zeratul's friend. Maybe because he won't stop talking to himself. Zeratul, the extended car warranty representative? The prophecy was divided into fragments, each kept at separate shrines. I must gather them and depart this world. Oh today. no. Mindhawk, what did you do? In the service of Ayers of the Pigs. What? Is he... <laughs> Is he... <laughs> okay. Is he just gonna be there in the middle of the screen the entire mission long? Does he just spend the entire mission talking to himself? Amazing. 
Okay. This is one of the worst missions in the campaign normally. I actually don't like the... The more I play custom campaigns... The less I like the Zero Two missions. Not a fan. I feel rude interrupting him, so I'll just shut up. Honor commands. The first fragment of the prophecy. Soon all will be made clear. He just sells car warranty, guys. Is that a mostly a thing in the States? I've never heard anybody complain about people reaching out for extended car warranties in the Netherlands. I don't know where Mindhawk is from, but... Yeah, I think it's mostly just a meme at this point, but I think it came from the States, didn't it? What? You smell Zeratul, your dance moves suck? Yo, 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 yo! What? <laughs> that was mean, why did... Um, ah. Your car came with seven years warranty out of the box? I have no idea how much warranty my car has. I just cross my fingers and hope that nothing breaks. It's a good strategy, dude. I don't usually pay attention to such things very often. Maybe I should. I don't know. Now, you guys are also gonna teleport away, aren't you? Yeah, Vorazun doesn't love you? What? People call your phone to offer extended car warranty in the US? Yeah, yeah, so it's like a scam, right? Basically. Where people just, you know, tell you that you have to fill out your details and stuff. People have cars in the Netherlands, Corey, believe it or not. Can I win this from here? No, I'm gonna have to do that a little bit differently. Pay us $200 a month for us to do nothing when your car breaks. Dude, that's a deal. That's a sick deal. So you can just give somebody money and get nothing in return? You've got an automatic... Wait, you got a four-wheel automatic bike in the Netherlands, Rico? That's amazing. Always fun seeing custom StarCraft 2 campaigns. It is a lot of fun. Thank you very much, Stormfire. Oh no. This is so annoying. Do I have to kill this? I just teleport out, no? Oh, I can't see my own unit! Don't I just teleport out after a little bit? Isn't there like gonna be high ground vision here at some point? I don't actually know. Maybe that's only the mutalisk section earlier. I'm a little lower in hit points than I would have liked to be at this point, but... I think I just killed a ground unit and I win. Honor ah. See now, creature? Ayer was your fault, your dance moves suck. Yo! God, it gets worse. It's getting worse. Stop. I will 
The final section of this mission is gonna be nearly impossible, dude. That is right. Please don't kill the bonus. What? No, that's the only reason I'm doing these missions, to get the bonus. Um... Just to be in character? Excellent. Is it getting annoying yet? I want to try and kill that spine. It's kind of hard to see. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I can definitely bass boost my voice too, but don't really know if it achieves anything. It's gonna be kind of difficult to understand me too. That's my actual voice, by the way. Normally, I have to tune my voice down. That's yeah, a real voice reveal. I'm like a VTuber now. Loco VTuber StarCraft games? Oh, yeah. Womp womp? There we go! Woo! Let's go, dude! Get the bonus objective! Little bit of damage! Get away! Blink to the high ground! Sorry. <laughs> WTF did I just join? No worries, dude. Ah! I can't see! So annoying. <laughs> no, 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 don't, don't die. Don't die now. I should heal up when I get to the next bonus objective. I can't do a, a Protal's voice effect, guys, because, like, the Protal's voices, they have, like, an echo that starts before the actual voice. <laughs> Unless my entire voice somehow is delayed. I don't think it's possible. <laughs> oh, jeez. It's getting worse! Zero Two is your extended car warranty representative. Yeah. He actually has an amazing deal right now. If you sell extended car warranty to four of your friends, you get 80% of the money. And then if you sell that information to one of your friends, who then sells it to four of their friends, you actually get 20% of, well, not quite 20%, but you get, you get a portion of their, it, it's amazing, dude. Highly recommend it. Just reach out to Zero Tool. He'll be able to give you all the info you ever need. <laughs> My thanks, mighty one. I like how it's ramping up now. It's gotten progressively worse. Nobody wants to hang out with me, dude. Nobody wants to be my friend. It's a little difficult, but I know where to go, so we should be alright. He's talking about overmind tendrils and Ehan crystals now? Oh no. I guess the la or disabling that one doesn't do me much good, huh? Are you supposed to hear this many voices in your head, or is this just uh? Because this this is normal, right? I'm yeah yeah. This is this is just normal actually. What? Wait, I, I looked away! What was the detection? Where did it come from? Oh, 
If you hear more than five voices, that's when you should go see a doctor. Oh, okay. I usually only hear four. I guess actually one of these spores probably got me. POV, you are trying to remember things while writing the test. God. Tests. Never been a fan. I always kind of felt like I was good at them. Pretty good at retaining information for a little while. But... Just the idea of thinking about it gives me anxiety. I still get this from time to time, and apparently this is not uncommon. Where... I wake up in the middle of the night thinking I forgot finishing or submitting a paper that's due. Even though I haven't been in school for years and years and years. Um, so I don't know what they're doing to see me. Huh? What's the detector here? I guess I can kill the roaches, but I don't know what the detector here is. There's a spore crawler over there, but that's not gonna be in range. Is it? Oh, now it's fine. Weird. We must act! <laughs> Maybe there's an overseer or something. You think there's an overseer over here somewhere? No, you might be right. You can't actually make it back that way. I have to go the other way? Oh yeah, I have to kill the Zork in his area. That's true. My yep. life for Aya, my soul for Aya, my mind for Aya, my voice for Aya, my sanity for Aya, my blade for Aya, my left frontal lobe for Aya, my eyes for Aya, my wife for Aya. Whoa, 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 what? Your wife what now? Guys, how in the world do I do this last section actually? I have no idea. There's too much damage. Uh, there's two spores. Yeah, I have to kill the detection. That is true. But there's no way I can kill the detection. Maybe I need to kill that first before doing this whole area? Maybe I can let him bleed out on the creep? I just wait 10 minutes now? <laughs> it's, it's the, I mean, I was gonna go get coffee. And at the very least, if I go AFK right now, you guys won't be alone. All right, I'm gonna go get coffee. I'll be back in a little bit. Zeratul will be here for you though, so at least the voices in your head, they, uh, they will be okay. Yeah. All right, I'll be back in a minute. Oh, no. Um, did my viewer count drop or I don't know what happened, man. Did my viewer count go down or? Okay. <sighs> Wait, what? Oh, I still have to kill these units over here? Ha! Oh. Should I lower the volume for you? How's that? Is that better? Someone please explain what's going on. Louder? Oh, okay, okay, okay. There you go. I love this. Oh. Now I'm finally not alone. Oh. 
Is this just a normal stream? Oh, don't worry about it, King Tiny Chip. We're doing a custom campaign and it turns out uh, Zeratul... I mean, he's like 700 years old and now mentally it's showing that he is a little bit on the... Uh, the older end of things. Hello, Loco. Is this a horror game? Is this a horror game? Yes. Real-time strategy mixed with horror, my favorite combination of genres. Thank you very much, Historiolo. Historiolo? Historio. Oh. Thank you for two months. Okay, I think I win now. I still have to escape, though. Here we go. I must get to the void before the Zerg overwhelms Oh no. I can't see shit. I don't know. Am I winning? My dog. <laughs> so fucking stupid. This mission took me like twice as long as the dig. Ah. Silence. Would you be silent? Ah, there it is. 35 minutes. Yeah, the dig only took me 28. That's what she said. No, no, no. It, sorry, I can't say the words the dig and not. Anyways. Oh, right. The gnome on the on the on the windmill. I do some very light spicy food. Um Let's see. There's a wooden hatch over here. Uh I need to shut down this thing by the way. Gil, can you maybe like throw some fire or something? I don't know how I, how I stop this. Maybe freeze? Yeah. Maybe freeze the mechanism that would work. No, I didn't actually target the thing. Oh, here, there's a brake lever. I thought I had to pull both of them as a break. So I figured I'd start with the one on the right. Turns out that is the release the break lever. No, 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 we're not safe. I I'm not gonna safe scum like that. I'm not, I'm not gonna safe scum like that. <sighs> that was a good yeet. I'm gonna save it as a matter of fact. I did release him. He is a free man now. I think it's kind of lame if we, if we safe scum a lot of it. Yeah, a little bit of safe scumming maybe, but it was a good trajectory, yeah. No, 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 we're not gonna disengage. Bleed for me. <laughs> In my mind, that was a smarter move than it actually was. I don't wanna hear it, chat. It still dealt a lot of damage. Yeah, but you know, there's a lot of games lately that are like absolutely massive, but that really don't have to be like a 100 plus gigabyte type of game. What the hell are you doing? <clears throat> Sorry. Smash. 
Ruin smash. I'll smash you. Jeez. <laughs> what the f All right, that came out of nowhere. Ruin smash. In a barn as well, huh? There's a bunch of mangled corpses here. That's where you guys are uh making love. No, 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 no. I should have knocked it. Yeah, I didn't consider knocking. I just saw a dark spot on my map and that's where I went. Boom, baby. Sorry. Sorry, lads. Really? That was a very high percentage chance to make it. I did not expect that when I first barged in here. I don't know. My pleasure. What? What the? F How did I lose a diamond back there? What the? What happened? Oh, I tech. I attacked my own diamond back. Is that what happened? Lavanda blesses the rising. This is it. This has got to be the place. What's he doing? Why is he sacrificing the baby? The statue starts to rotate, <sighs> but its rusty jam mechanism jams Tell stuck. The statue starts to rotate, but its rusty mechanism jams stuck. I can get grease. You think that's that's the first thing that goes through my head? I don't know, no. Yeah, I need I need some WD forty. Nearly had it. The statue starts to rotate, but it's rusty. I felt smart for once. Jam stuck. I felt I felt clever for once. Doesn't happen very often. Moving in. I'll give it a shot. Ready and willing. There we go. Well, it's greased up right now, no? The statue starts to rotate, but its rusty mechanism jams stuck. More grease. Lube it up. Nearly had it. Making me sweat. Okay, now it's properly lubed. There you go. It worked. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it though. I can rotate the hell out of it, but Bids the setting sun a fond farewell. Where is the setting sun? There's no. We're underground, no? Lathander blesses. I have now turned them both a full loop. Is there anything in these things? Stop pretending, Loco. I know, I know, I know. Do Do you want me to turn it towards the window? Is that towards the window? Doesn't really look like it's towards the window. Let me at it. Yeah, you guys know the solution to this problem, but not me. Oh, hold up. Lavanda blesses the rising bountiful. Ah, this one has to go east, the other one has to go west. That ain't it. That should be it, no? Lavanda blesses the rising. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Sorry. Sun. East. Okay, my I f I forgot I turned it. Okay, east is this way. Dude, I'm a fucking idiot. Okay, east is that way. West, west is that way. Okay, okay, we gotta go that way. No, we have we have a thingy on the map. That's it. There it is. I'm a gamer. So in this game called IRL, there's a thing called the sun. And the sun, it's a, uh, 
It's an object that flies around in space. And in IRL, you're also on a rock that rotates around the sun while the sun flies around in space. Yeah. And since the Earth also rotates on its... Or the, the, sorry, the, the rock that you're flying... Since it rotates on its... It's a bit confusing. You thought the rock was flat? That makes no sense, dude. I mean the rock disc. Yeah, I meant the disc, yes. The rock is a wrestler loco? Oh yeah. So there's this the the sun rotates around the rock. Wait no. The rock rotates around the sun. Uh Asterion, you should be the one. You're the one that I want. Dude, that is a lot of bonuses. I can basically not fail this now. <laughs> basically! Try again. Okay, don't be an idiot. There it is. Huge roll, man. Huge roll. 29. What? No, no, no. I already disarmed it. Disarmed it, bro! Wait, what did I do differently? I lockpicked it? I didn't disarm it yet? I wiped my entire party! I unlocked it, but I didn't disarm? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, so do I have to do that fight again? I don't even know the last time I saved. Mate, this is ages ago. Was there no quick save? Bro, that sucks ass. Yeah, this was th this was the the most recent save, which is a while ago. Uh, that's about 15 minutes ish. <sighs> Just because I did not quite realize that disarming and lockpicking were two separate actions. Lesson learned, I suppose. Yeah, I could probably sell junk over here as well. Not really what I want to do now, though. I want to go back to the exact same spot that I was already in. I am going to try and do a crazy thing and open this heavy chest. This arm. We'll add a bonus. We'll roll the dice. Okay, we got the roll. Now I lockpick. Let's crack it open. Same deal. We hit the correct number. Now I open the chest. Right? <laughs> Any mimics in this? No, no, no. I just exploded everything. It was a bit of a mess. Hey, there we go. Excellent. First try. You love to see it. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. Investigate the pool. Some dialogue options require a skill check, a dice roll that must meet or exceed a target number. Your character skill adds a bonus to this roll. Okay. Easy roll. Easy. Wait, I have a minus one because of my intelligence? I am pretty dumb. How did the game know? The casing is fragile. The slightest touch could cause it to crumble. What do you mean sounds about right? Good start. Really good start. I love everything about that. I've already face tanked my way through the very first assignment. Yeah, stirs in trepidation. I do. You have the ledger. Here, buddy. We have it. Her lies, her guilt. Madeline reported her friends to a dark justicia and fled when they were butchered. 
Well, she flees no more. I will be the conduit for Madeline's spirit. I will force her to face trial. And you will be the judge. Oh, yeah, by the way, this guy gave me a quest, and I'm playing a pretty evil dude. Um, so we are, uh, basically, um... Ah, oh, we're doing some f***ed up things. Yeah, we're doing, um... Okay, fine, chat. Tell me. Start a community poll. Let's see if the community polls work today. I think I'll just kill you instead. I'm going to punish her thoroughly. Th Wait, no. Thoroughly. <laughs> I think that's a typo. Let's see what she has to say first. I'm here to make sure she sees justice. Uh, you vote using the Baldur's Gate extension. Yes. Okay. Here we go. The Raven was right. We were fated to meet. Break her, my friend. Most thoroughly. <laughs> this is messed up. She's already dead, by the way. In case you're confused. Uh, the lady we are uh, punishing is already dead. Witness. <sighs> oh, jeez. Are you okay, buddy? I think I'm helping out some sort of crazy psychopath serial murderer. You. He said I was going to be punished. That you'd be the judge. But I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Wait, 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 wait. I have to hit him. It's all right. I'm not here to judge you. You're... You're not. But he said I deserved it. The time. Evil. No, I was just here to hurt you, dude. Not to judge you. I said it didn't mean nothing. That Ben and Mark were just drunk and whining. Ben and Mark? I know Ben and Jerry. Who's Mark? Promised she was going to chat with him. She promised. What did the dark justiciar actually do to your friends? Don't blame others for what you did. Yeah, don't blame others for what you did, dude. You didn't see it. Didn't see what the dark justiciar did. She gave him a dagger each. And told him to press it against their stomachs <laughs> on the count of three. To start stabbing. And not stop <laughs> till she said so. What the fuck is happening? Stop. I'd do anything to take it back. Anything. Oh my god, anything? Then hurt yourself like Ben and Mark did? Pathetic, you murdered your friends? You're a coward? There's nothing you need to do, this wasn't your fault, I promise. Okay, chat, let's see. Now that a lot of you have more... extensions ready to go. You guys love the evil sh You guys want to see the most gory, nasty things in this game, I've noticed. There's a lot of ones. Yeah, usually with these... <laughs> Chat's pretty evil, dude. I feel like I am not evil enough. Okay, our first die roll of the day. I try to do an evil playthrough, but I'm not very good at being evil, it turns out. You guys are educating me, I guess. Alright. We got it. You guys are here to help. Thank you, guys. Yet you guys shouted at me for letting little Timmy go into the generator in Frostpunk. Somehow I was the bad guy there. I feel... That is 17 gradations below whatever's going on here, man. Like this? <laughs> Prove it. Do it for Ben and Mark. You guys want me to go with one? Fucking hell. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't say stop. Yeah, I, what, the, what the hell, bro? I didn't say stop. Why did she stop? Asterion is, yeah, he's like, yeah, yeah, this is right. I'm sorry. I feel so bad. Vile sadist. <laughs> what have you done to me? 
Right, you you taught me to punish her, mate. Not to the point of killing this body. You will join me in the darkness of oblivion. You treacherous insect. Well, I just listened to him. Oh, he only lost ten hit points, guys. I'm gonna make him lose a lot more. Sounds like fun. <laughs> See, that's a good start. He already took more damage. Counter spell that. The boy, I'm gonna have to kill the bird as well. He wasn't trying that hard if he only did that much damage to himself. Yeah, I don't know, dude. Let us finish this indeed. All right. Don't want. I don't want to kill the bird. Okay, fine. We'll have to kill the bird, I guess. Sorry, bird. Let me tell you about the bird crap. The bird attacked me. He attacked me first. Anyways, um, I uh, did the thing. Y yay. He had a note. He who was, what ills thy mind? The queen was clear. A full retreat to the shadow fell with all due haste. You beheld the fate of lover's whisper. After a ten day in the darkness, she knew not her name. These lands are rich in tragedy and memory, but our minds are vulnerable to the malignant curse. Lover's whisper strangled her own raven this morn. Her raven. The queen was incensed at the loss of her child and struck lover's whisper down, as was her right. Return at once, or I will be forced to report your desertion. Of thine will. Okay. Um... We, uh, did it? Do I take the ledger? No, I don't think I need the ledger. We'll leave it over here. I'm kind of just leaving a trail of blood behind. We've completed the quest, right? I got my XP, I guess. She had $62 on her. Nice. Um, I don't know how much more there is remaining to this act, but I guess we'll, uh... Why do I look so uneasy? Because I just did a really messed up thing and I honestly feel bad for my virtual video game characters. This game is not real, right? Like, the, it's, a, it's, a, it's a game, right? Twitch chat has very little mercy here. 